But uh, anyway, so uh, on Tucker Carlson's program, uh, Resident Fascist, uh, Tucker Carlson had the governor of R. Kansas um, on to describe why the governor chose to veto the anti-trans bill that was kicked back to the state legislature and then overridden. So it became law anyway. Uh, but it was a, basically a symbolic gesture. And so Tucker Carlson has Asa Hutchinson on, uh, a Republican governor of Arkansas, to ask, why do you think uh, that it's okay? Well, I mean, I, you know, I can't even set this up. Just listen. To this in the most sensitive issues. Then, and then, so, then sure, why are, we, then, pro why are we regulating the behavior of children at all if we're allowing children to decide? And by the way, I read a study today that showed the overwhelming majority of kids who do not take life-altering hormones in the end decide not to quote transition to a new sex so th there's a lot going on here but i'm just what it's like okay all right i'm sorry but this one is just like okay so you're telling me kids that don't take hormones or puberty blockers aren't trans listen to this who do not take life-altering hormones in the end decide not to quote transition so if they don't take hormones if they don't take puberty blockers they don't transition incredible statistic that's incredible wow tucker carlson breaking news right here into a new sex so th there's a lot going on here but i'm i'm asking as a, as a conservative you just incited i love how asa hutchinson is just looking at him like what <laughs> He's just like, look at his face. Like, I, I mean, he's just like. Who do look not take life altering hormones in the end decide not to quote transition to a new sex. So th there's a lot going on here, but I'm, I'm asking as a, as a conservative, you just incited, invoked Ronald Reagan as if he were for chemical castration of children. What other behavior should we not use the power of the state to regulate among kids? Seriously. Well, Why you debate it every time. And so, look, Tucker, you want to keep talking or you want me to answer a question? Tucker, I sincerely whenever want you, to you d Well, thank you. <laughs> and so whenever you, whether it's it's beer for minors, these are all bear. issues that you have to God address. Goddamn beer for minors. Judgment calls on it. But we also try to restrain ourselves as conservatives and say we don't have to be involved in every issue. And if you want to broaden the party, if you want to get back to the principles, then let's at least think through in a reasoned way as to whether this is the right bill to interfere with parents and doctors' decisions on a health care matter, as you pointed out. So basically what uh, this guy is saying is that I thought we were conservatives. I thought we were for getting the government out of people's health care. I thought we were for smaller government. That's basically his argument. I'm an old school conservative from way back, bro. From way back, right? Like, I mean, like, come on, man. Has does not have thorough research in every area. And so I yield to that. <laughs> but and you, whenever you look at this you, bill, in you my You yield veto to the lack of, of research. It. Really quick, 10 years ago, if somebody had said, hey, Asa Hutchinson, you're going to be governor. Yes, you yield to the lack of research. So he, he reports that to be preposterous. So if I put forth a bill that says, I am going to ban, uh, I'm going to ban, let's say, I'm going to ban uh, plastic uh, Blu ray cases. Because I don't know, man, the science isn't really in on that. Uh, you know, like they could be dangerous, man, who knows? So, and then like, and then if someone were to respond with, well, there's no supporting evidence that they're dangerous, why would you ban them when they're so ubiquitous? I would be like, I don't, are you saying there's no evidence? You yield to there being no evidence? It's like, what? It's like, if I were to like try to ban toilet paper, right? It's like, all right, well, you know, I think that it's, you know, there's this and that. And then someone else is like, well, there's no real supporting evidence that toilet paper is bad or whatever. It's like, so you're yielding to no support of it. Yes. Like, what? I, I of Arkansas. And you're going to veto a bill that would have protected children from chemical castration. What do you think you would have said? Well, just like I said today, if you're talking about a reassignment surgery, I would have signed that bill in a minute. But whenever you're talking about maybe less than 200 kids in Arkansas. I love how Asa Hutchinson is just saying like, oh, if you're talking about any other kind of trans thing, I would have said, fuck them trannies, get rid of them, man. I hate the trans trenders, man. But you know, I'm just, this bill ain't the right kind of anti-trans discrimination, man. I'm a conservative from way back. We gotta, if we're gonna discriminate, we gotta do it right.
that's currently on hormone treatment and they are immediately cut off without having a grandfather clause in this legislation, I don't think that's treating those kids or their parents or their yeah. health care providers fairly or equally. All right. That's the conservative position. Governor, thanks. So Appreciate apparently it. Tucker Carlson just had no response for that. It's like, oh, wait, you're going to take people off of medication with no research onto how that does or, or how that works? Oh, great. Okay. Well, I have no response. Interview's over. It's over. What? I don't know, man. I just like, that's so bizarre. I love those situations where like both people yell at each other and they're both garbage. Like, I mean, it's just, I don't know. It's, it's a little ridiculous. But again, this is the absolute state of American politics. Let me just say, and it's not good. It is not good. Um, but uh, it's, it's really bizarre to, to kind of be trans in this moment. Uh, you know, it's like, you know, a little scary little freaky uh you know just people's like yeah i don't believe that you know you as a person should exist or be allowed to exist if i had my way i would kill you instantly oh that, that makes me feel great thank you tucker i appreciate that but you know there you go fuck fuck 